today we're going to start out by multiplying fractions. And a lot of kids get uh, scared of doing this type of uh, fraction problem because the, common, the denominators aren't the same. They get it mixed up with adding and subtracting and think they have to have a common denominator. But multiplying fractions is actually the easiest to do because all you do is multiply straight across the top and then multiply straight across the bottom and you'll get your answer. So three times one is three, 10 times two is 20, and that's my answer. That's all you have to do when you're multiplying fractions. Dividing fractions is a little bit different because you, you end up multiplying, but there's a process you have to do before you multiply. It's called keep, change, flip, and what that means is this first thing, you're gonna keep it exactly the same. Oh, sorry. And then the second thing, you're going to change it to multiply. And the third thing, you're going to flip it. So I'm going to put the one on the bottom and the six on top. So keep, change the sign to multiply, flip the last one. And then just like we multiplied, you multiply straight across. I get six. Multiply straight across the bottom, I get two. And you can simplify it, but this is okay too.